Hello guys, welcome to the fifth episode of my full playthrough of Mega Aquarium. In today's episode, we're going to be playing through Metropolis, I believe it's called. So now we're in, here's the greeting crap, which I really don't care about. And here's my first achieve- oh nice, okay. So the first one is you win. Reach rank 7, earn 1700 money, and have 24 different animals. Okay, so it's not giving me all the other crap where it's like, do all this, do all that. It's just giving me the ending goal straight away. So I'm going to go ahead and delete everything so I can start building this the way I want to be built. Now that everything's built, I'm going to recolor this so that way it is using the proper skin. There we go. Fix all of this. And now I'm going to be actually expanding it to the appropriate size that I want it to be. I have $7,000 to start out with, so I could probably expand this just a little bit more. And I could probably buy two tanks on each side, which is pretty nice for a uh, starting setup. Nice, and I start out with the deep wall tank, which is always absolutely amazing. I was actually wrong, I need two more on each side. And then after that, I'm gonna close everything off. Feeding, fixing, gift shop, that guy's perfect. Feeding, fixing, talking, I don't really care about that. And then this guy for just Eating, which should work well. I'm not gonna hire another person because I do need money right now, so I'll hire another person in a little bit. I think I'm probably gonna start out with what do I have? Cold water. Just those guys. Mm. Probably just a grouper tank, I'm, I'm thinking, yeah. Oh, wait, <laughs> never mind. I can't house multiple of these guys in the same tank. I'm just going to start out with a community tank then with a bunch of fish in it. So real quick, I'm going to get this tank set up. And then once I get all the stuff on it, I'll uh, show you what I'm putting in it. So it is a little bit under filtered, although it should be fine for the time being. So I'm going to go ahead and start sticking some fish in here. A few of these, a few of those. These guys need some caves. This costs 300 should be fine. I think that's all they require. Okay, that is all they require. So now all I need to do is just buy some simple food. Go ahead and open up. Ooh, nice. Uh, guide bookshelf because that gives me money. And ooh, I have rank five and rank six. I think what I'm gonna start out with is probably what these guys eat. Uh, this guy right here, I want the ras because I can have this with my other cold water fish and I can start a cold water tank, which would be pretty cool for one of the starting tanks. Also, I think since I can afford to do so and this tank is self-sufficient, I am going to sell this and I'm going to buy a better version. And there we go. I'm also going to buy a few of these guys to go in here so that whenever I do end up getting fish with plant needs, they will already be met. Now looking through these fish, I think I'm actually going to end up getting a, f a one of each of these, or actually maybe two of each, yeah. Dude, not enough money? Okay, nice. So I'm actually not going to do multiple of those. I think I'm going to save up a little bit of money first, and then I'll buy a few of these guys. What I'm going to do is I'm going to save up $2,000, so I'll come back once I have $2,000, uh, and I'm going to purchase a few more fish. Okay, so real quick, even though I only have a thousand buckaroonies right now, I'm going to go ahead and buy a few things to make me just a little bit extra money and also a bench so that way people will be a little bit more happy about being in here. And there we go, that should be perfectly fine. I'm also going to go ahead and buy a sponge and a broom and such, so that way when people do inevitably throw their garbage everywhere like animals, my people can clean it up. Also, I need a tool station because, as you can tell, 
Uh, I kind of forgot about that, maybe just a little bit. But, uh, there you go. They'll fix all that and the tank will be filtered properly. There we go, I'm up to $2,000. So I'm gonna go ahead and fill this tank fully with fish and then I'm gonna start putting cold water fish in here. Even though I currently only have the one, I will put the air one in there as soon as I can uh, unlock him and put him in there and whatnot. Buy a second one of those. Buy two of those guys. And I wonder, can, okay, cannot be housed with bullies. Uh, none of these guys are bullies, so I do believe I can actually have another one of these. Yep, okay, so I can have one of those in there. I can't have multiple because he doesn't like his own kind for some reason. Same thing with this guy. I can have one of those. And I believe this is friendly. Yes, this guy is also friendly. So I can have one of those. Well, I could have multiple, but I'm only going to stick one in there for the time being. This guy is also friendly, so I'm going to stick him in there as well. I need clam. And I need the... whatever these are. And there we go. The tank should be completely sufficient. Yeah, so it's at 80 instead of 75, so this tank is very, very filtered. Has all the requirements met. All the fish appear to be happy and fine. It's not completely full. In fact, it's only halfway full. Really quickly, since it is only halfway full, I'm going to stick a few more of these smaller fish in there. Stick a few more of those. A few more of those. And then also, I'll buy another eel and another cheese. And there we go. Oh, wait, actually, now it's uh, uh, two full. So a few of those. So a few of those. There we go. Now it's appropriately done and full fish. I'll come back to you whenever this tank is fully filtered and cooled or chilled. Now sadly as of right now I only have these small chillers so I, it's really hard to actually chill this thing but here in a minute I will unlock the appropriately sized chillers and I'll actually be able to uh, chill it. Stick four of those guys in there and they like the shrimp. Grab those. I also need to buy another tool station. And that's basically it. This tank is done. They have no requirements to be met. Already up to getting 300 and... Yeah, 300. So it wants me to reach rank 7, but in total it wants me to get 1700. Okay, okay. I already have 10 different animals, which is nice. So I think what I'm going to do here is I'm going to do one more tank and I'm going to do like a cross and I'm going to do one side which is all really small tanks for just finishing the 24 animals because for animals like the uh where are they discovery tropical for animals like these lionfish I really don't want to have an entire tank dedicated to them so I am just going to limit it to one small tank full of them since they cannot be housed with other fish besides themselves and it's just kind of annoying and I'll probably do the same thing for like the grouper. The grouper cannot be housed with other fish besides himself, or I mean he can be housed with other fish but he'll eat them. And uh, also he does not like having himself in there so I can't make a tank completely full of them so he's just gonna be a solo fish. But anyways, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and start building the next set of deep wall tanks. Okay. So now both of these tanks are appropriately heated and filtered, and I already have everything closed off, so now all that's left to do is to actually buy the fish to go into these tanks. I think I am going to try to do a coral grouper in one of these tanks along with some other fish, although I am not exactly sure uh, what kinds of other fish I'd be able to have in there. I could, could do these guys because they are too big for him to eat, so that could work. In fact, that might, I think that might be what I do. So I'll go ahead and stick one coral, coral grouper in there, and then I could just do a large, I mean very large amount of these guys. So they like that, that, and clam, so... 
these clamps over there, and those are already so close to this, I'm not even going to bother buying them again. It's, they're perfectly fine. However, I am going to buy a tool station just to be closer to the filters and heaters and such. But I'm going to go ahead and buy these fish. I'm going to buy, start with five of those and five of these. Not enough money, that's fine. And why is it saying that these guys are very unhappy? They need rocks, plants, and they need a place to hide. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and save up another thousand dollars really quickly so that way I can afford all of this stuff. Okay, I have a thousand dollars and I just unlocked the rest. So I'm going to go ahead and stick this guy in here in a minute. Uh, but the next unlock I think is going to be, hmm, what do I want? I think the starfish, I'll take the starfish. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and decorate this tank now so that way everybody will be happy and stop wanting to kill themselves. Oh nice, I also unlocked the guide bookshelf which is going to give me a little bit extra income. I'm going to go ahead and get the large chiller because I do need that for this cold water tank. Now I'm going to buy some of these guys. I do believe, okay yeah. So these are perfectly fine to go in here. They shouldn't be like angry or anything. Or, so yeah, that should be fine. I'm going to go ahead and hire our employees strictly for, actually, uh, feeding, fixing, talking. I think I'm just going to get one strictly, ooh, never mind, I'm getting both of those. Could not grow, okay. So I need to fix this because this guy can't grow, tank is apparently completely full. What I'm going to do to fix that, I think, is just sell this guy and sell that. Okay, that should be fine, they should be able to grow now. I need them to uh, fix all this stuff. They did fall a little bit behind because I was lacking on employees for a minute there. But uh, I think everything's fine at this point. Oh, uh, I thought I put fish in there a second ago, but apparently I just didn't. Nah, I'm joking. I know I did. Uh, apparently they can eat them when they're first born though. So they get six to 13. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't notice that. I thought it was five. What I'm going to do in that case is I'm just going to sell all of these for a second. I'm going to go ahead and purchase six of those. I'm going to let them grow by literally just one. And then after that, I will uh, put the other guys in so that way these guys can eat them. Oh, nice. Starfish. So now I need, I'm going to get the shark, I think. There you go. They're satisfied now. I don't know why they're not cleaning that. Uh, I'm pretty sure one of my employees is cleaning. Do they not? They do not. Okay, so I need somebody with cleaning really quick. Feeding and cleaning should be fine, so she can go clean all that stuff. At this point, I'm going to go ahead and sell these walls because there isn't really much of a point to them anymore. And with this being open now, I'm going to buy a few more vending machines. And I'm also going to buy some more benches and trash cans and such. So I'll get back to you here in a second when I do all that. Staff zoning. So it's, t it's suggesting that I give my staff certain zones to work in, which would make them more efficient. But uh, if you throw enough money at it, it will work. So I don't particularly care. Oh, nice, got the chiller. Last but not least, I need another toilet. And I'm gonna sell all these now. I'm gonna buy a larger chiller. Which can, oh dang, actually can't. I don't know why it single-handedly did that last time, but apparently it can't now. Weird. Everything's closed off, but somehow there are two people back here for some reason. That was weird. But anyways, everything is now done and ready, and I don't know what I'm going to put in here quite yet. Although I, I think I'm going to start expanding this way so I can buy some of these smaller tanks for the lionfish, like I said. I could do, you know what, I think what I'm going to do actually is I'm going to do corals. These guys are like mega expensive, so I'm going to go ahead and just start out with a few, just so the tank's not empty. So, so these lights are quite buggy because last time it displayed 150 and it 
didn't give it to me for 150, it gave it gave it to me for 1500. It's displaying 150 and I have 2000 and it won't let me buy it. So it is just being very buggy for some reason or another. I'm going to come back whenever I purchase this light. So that time it took over $2000. I do not know what is wrong with this game and why it doesn't like these lights so much. Okay, I'll come back whenever I fill this tank up fully with corals, which may or may not take me a minute. So now I can unlock another coral, which is always nice. There we go, I'm done. And I'm not even going to do this quest because it only gives me $2,000 and it's just a bunch of random buttons I don't feel like pressing. Cool, I've fully unlocked all of that, so now all that's left is for me to actually reach rank 7, unlock a few more different fish, and uh, I'm almost there. I'm halfway, over halfway there, so slowly getting there. And at this point, I do believe it has been long enough to where I can shove a few of these in there, although apparently the tank is full, so I'm going to sell two of those. And I'm going to replace them with two of those. So now all of these tanks are fully completed. And ignore the three rocks on this because I, I'm not giving this guy his three rocks. He does not deserve them. And also he's clearly blind because there's all these rocks in the tank. But, you know, apparently that doesn't count for some reason. I'm going to expand everything now. Which I'm probably going to have to save up like $5,000. So I'm just going to do that real quick. I'll come back when I have like five, $6,000. Okay, so I'm back. I have $6,300, well, now $400, and I'm going to go ahead and start expanding down this way. I'm just going to cut to the point where I have the tanks set up because this is going to be pre-born. Or actually, you know what? I'll just do a time lapse instead. Okay, so there I go. Now everything's done. It was a little overcomplicated because I tried to fit these in here, but I obviously couldn't get it, as you could tell by the time lapse. Uh, I'm going to turn this tank into a lionfish tank. I'm going to do, I think, two of those. And then I'll do, like, six of those. And that should be fine, I think. They both leak. They both eat the clams, so that should be fine. Okay. These guys want some caves, but besides that, I think this tank is set to go. And yep, this tank is done. Ooh, I wonder if anybody... Yep, there are some people have leveled up. Mostly need feeding. Ooh, okay, so this is actually useful because it grants me extra prestige. So I'm going to do whatever this wants. So that should be relatively easy. That doesn't sound like a hard request. I'm not going to do this because it's pointless. I'm going to go ahead and buy a large tank. Okay, so I have $5,000 now. What I'm going to do uh, for this tank since I cannot fit all of the filtration behind it is I'm just going to close up the back and I'm going to make a little room off to the side like over here should be fine. There, so now the tank is just barely filtered by the shark. Where's the fish? There's the fish. And they're fine. Their water quality is fine. All I need to do is give them some plants and some rocks. Everybody loves rocks. I'm going to go ahead and open this up since I really don't have much of a reason to keep it closed. I am going to go ahead and buy a few more staff at this point. There we go. All I have to do is wait for these guys to grow. And I think that's actually what I'm going to do. So I'll come back whenever these guys grow or I achieve this goal. Okay, so they still haven't fully grown, however, I did achieve this goal, and I'm almost done achieving this goal too. 
Yeah, and this gives me more than enough ammo to achieve it with. Cool, I don't really care about that, because all it does is uh, give me a little bit extra money, I'm pretty sure. Oh, cool, so this actually does give me base prestige, so I am actually going to do this. Where is it at? Do I already have it unlocked? I do. So, with this, all you do is you just you place it down, and then you go buy a mic headset. You can just shove that right there. Now, how do I do this? Because I actually don't know. Select your podium. Topic. The epaulette shark. Okay, there we go. I really don't care about this all that much. It's just, it's so pointless. <laughs> but uh, that gave me a bit, a hundred plus my base prestige, which is actually pretty useful. And then this will give 200 whenever these guys become fully grown, which shouldn't take too long. And there it is. I'm gonna go ahead and get the mega filter or whatever. I'm about to unlock this guy whenever he's unlocked. I do have to wait for these to get fully grown because if I don't, he can't eat them. He can't eat up to 10. This guy gets to 18. And I believe he, yeah, he only gets to 16. Actually, uh, they should already be big enough. I can have them in there. This guy is cold water. I'm going to go with the green moray eel. Oh, nice. Okay, the unicorn stur surgeon fish or sturgeon fish or whatever already fully grown, which is nice. All I gotta do is wait on the epileptic shark. But without further ado, I'm gonna go ahead and put three of these guys in there, which should be fine. I'm like 90% sure. Uh, hopefully I'm not wrong about that. He has food now. When they get bigger, I might actually have to buy a better filter for this tank, but really quickly, I'm just gonna replace all of these with a single mega heater. Jeez, that is just barely under. In fact, it's so barely under, I can use a small to finish it off. Since I currently have literally every fish I'm allowed to have, I'm going to wait until I unlock the moray eel, and then I'm going to put it in here. So I'll come back whenever I unlock that. Green moray eel, that's nice. Unlock this. Where's the moray eel? How big does it get? To 28. So I can just do him in there all by himself. He needs just a tad bit of caves. I clo oh, okay, I accidentally closed the rocks. I was looking for live rocks. I couldn't find it. Uh, it was because I accidentally closed it out. The stupid shark is taking a very long time to un uh, fully grow. But whenever they do fully grow, I'm pretty sure I will beat the game. Because that plus what I currently have is enough to beat the game. So I'm going to wait until this guy fully grows. I'm actually about to achieve my goal, even though I haven't uh, gotten the plus 200 to my base prestige, which is pretty nice. In fact, I think I'm just going to throw myself over by buying some more fish in this tank. I'm literally just going to fill it up with, like, a bunch of those. And there I go. So now this, this might actually throw me over. It might not at the same time, so I'll see here in a second. So close, it's still going up at a very consistent rate, and there we go. Different animals, oh crap. I need one more kind of animal, so I'm actually just gonna freeze time so it doesn't drop back down. Uh, I do wonder if I even need to have it properly cared for. I might just, there we go. You win, nice. Okay, so let me do my walkthrough real quick and then end out this episode so here's the starter tank with just a bunch of random fish in it over here is the cold water tank some random tank with the grouper in it i hate that grouper i absolutely despise him but not nearly as much as this little guy right there <laughs> and then all the uh don't half and half whatever they are over here, just a bunch of angelfish, I believe they were, or whatever they're called. The lionfish tank, of course. Then over here with the moray eel. Just chilling out. And then this tank, which is absolutely massive. It's actually taller than the walls. Which has quite a few fish in it. 
and I actually did end up achieving this goal because they're taking so long just to grow. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please don't forget to like and subscribe. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video, and if you did, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Also, go check out my TikTok and Instagram for high-quality footage and photos. See ya! Three, two, one.